My name is Anthony Hobley. I'm the Chief Executive Officer of the Carbon Tracker Initiative. This week I'm going to be attending Climate Week in Paris, um, and particularly the Climate Finance Day on the Friday, to talk about how we unlock the private sector capital that's going to be needed to fund the low carbon transition. So what is the fossil fuel risk premium? Well, our financial analysis, our carbon supply cost curves work, particularly with oil and coal, and we're beginning to see this emerge with our forthcoming gas report, shows us that a significant amount of capital is being deployed into what we term high cost, high carbon projects. Projects that will require a very high oil price, as high as $200 a barrel in some cases, um, with a very low, if, if, if negligible, a return on capital. Um, this leads us to the conclusion that the risk premium associated with fossil fuels is not being priced correctly. What our analysis tells us is the world is changing and it's not just climate policy, albeit that's one factor that's starting to have an impact. It's emerging technologies, efficiencies in the use of energy um, and the rising capital cost of finding, extracting and delivering fossil fuels to market contrast the dramatically falling costs of renewable energy. Um, there's a perfect storm of factors that are starting to affect demand for fossil fuels. Um, and you know, the markets, the financial markets, have not caught up um, in our view, hence why they do not fully, have not fully priced and understood the, the risk premiums associated with investing in fossil fuels.